Well, I think it's time to check on this. What are you doing there, Ganju? Do you know what is uh, inside? I guess you do. Nah, I don't know if I have the space here. We might have to go somewhere else. I need to make up my bed. Ugh. Let's gonna leave the computer. Let's gonna take this one. Let's gonna check what is inside, shall we? I got this one from Time Master because I think had been so much with um, social media in compensation as always I'm offering him some free publicity can you get this kind of thing? and he absolutely can so behold let me just pull it off one second yeah hands free can you please people recognize it? Eh, eh, eh. look we have an arrow if you think that it is what it is it is actually what it is look at that there is the other part there. Huh? Wouldn't be this great for a cosplay? Hey, look at this. Let me assemble it. Hold on. It should be like this. Sometimes it can get a little bit tricky. So you're supposed to put it like right here and then uh, slide it like this. So you can have your very own Amos bowl. <laughs> it needs the horn here. Or the pieces they are kind of modulo in wood some things they can be improved like uh, it came with this piece of glue just down there but that's fine we can remove the glue with a gun the painting is beautiful as well it's not 3d printed it's actual wood I consulted my cosplayer friends and they say that basically yeah this is uh, con legal so it wouldn't be any issue this one if broke and that one as well probably during transport because it's really feeble so you can see the details here it's so far so good like we have now an amos bow to do probably cosplay with it who knows <laughs> oh yeah and we need to put the hat there like this or something like that and it's supposed to insert here ah! seriously having a belly and standing it out sometimes it's good for hands off camera i'm glad i, I learned this technique Fit. Ah. Come on, fit now. Oh my god. Wasn't that hard the, the last time? Okay, done. I managed to fit it. Pretty much that's my own almost bow now. Yeah, Ganju, let's gonna go upstairs. Here it is. I fixed it and I managed to even string a bow. So I use my gun. You need to be very careful with it because I got a serious injury, which I'm not gonna show in my leaf and scar. Be careful with glue guns, people. They are dangerous. You need to be an expert or you need to at least uh, face the consequences of that happen. And he hasn't decided yet on how much he's gonna charge for these services. But one thing, it's um, you need to do it pre-order. They are not gonna be there in the shop. And I think it's a great opportunity for people to order their stuff so they don't go through customs. They go through the shop and the shop takes care of all the customs. It looks really great. And if I put it next to my... Look, it goes up to here. I'm not especially a small man. You need to be careful with that though. <laughs> you can't slide off. Just be aware it is a little bit modular. Okay? If you don't like it modular, you can always put glue here. Anyways, to merchandise hanger. <laughs> yeah, I hope that, that you like it. Eh? And uh, don't forget, order them from Time Master. Just go on Google. Put Time Master X Genshin. You can talk through Google. He also has a Twitter account. Thank you very much for this, Sandy. For all the pre goodies that you have been giving to me. I know that the old people are loving the shop. And I heard some magnificent stories from Andy. From people that have been showing up. Come on, show some love. Keep the shop alive. <laughs> you need to keep coming. <laughs> Thank you very much, people. Don't forget. I might be having some plans for that one.